in terms of the, who chooses the news stories, that's obviously got to be what the big stories are in the day. Uh, in terms of all the light stuff, as in light and shade in the show, I definitely get to put in a lot there. <laughs> and I get to, you know, I don't, if, some, if something's written in a certain way, I rewrite everything so it's my own style. And on air, well, basically I've got the megaphone, so if I decide that I want to ask a different question, as long as the producer's happy with it, they'll see where I'm going. Definitely have control there as well, but it's collaborative. Couldn't do it without a great producer behind me. Great team of producers, in fact. Here we go. Online. Digital television. DAB Digital Radio. Your sound across the UK. BBC Asian Network. Okay, here we go. Afternoon, it's four o'clock. You're listening to the BBC Asian Network. I'm Nikki Beatty. This is Drive, taking you through till 7.30. And coming up on the show today... How an Asian teenager killed in prison could have been a victim of a gladiator-style game. How easy is it for a stranger to steal your identity? And another lesson in our cricket for beginners, and you should be bros by now. First, here's your four o'clock news with Adam Pastanicki. Ten-year-old schoolboy is facing one link down, fifty-five to go. Found guilty at the old Bailey of murder. <laughs>